I don't know how to feel about one of the most badass anime characters being named after a soap brand. Wow. 2020 was a hectic year in many different kinds of ways. And oh boy, this year has been really good to my channel. I mean, just look at this graph. Over the past year, I've gained over 1,200 subs. I started this year out at 50, and now I'm at 1,320. The same goes for my views. I started out with around 1,000 views in total on my channel. We multiplied that number over 120 times. 120,000 views total. That's more views than people in Santa Fe, New Mexico, which honestly, it's insane to think about and I couldn't do it without your help from home. I guess what I'm trying to say is Thank you. Here's a compilation of just random clips from all the videos I've posted over this past year. And if you like what you see here, why not just like the video? And if you come back to this channel frequently and aren't subscribed, then why not hit that subscribe button? I mean, you're already seeing my content frequently. But that being said, hope you enjoy this best of 2021. Swordman breathes and fights demons with a demon. Awooga! What your favorite waifu says about you. Part 2. Ochako from My Hero Academia. Already? <sighs> So using this logic, if, let's say, Joe Biden were to have a good time with an anime wife, they would create this opposite, where there's no corruptness in them. Zhao, you think you can do all the fighting moves you see in the Naruto openings? Nagisa Shiota, Assassination Classroom. I'm not gay, but a bit back, I made an anime pack where I just replaced a bunch of things with anime characters, and we're gonna be playing Bedwars with that. The day I'm recording this is the day after I posted the uh, the second sauce video. So basically, I'm tired is what I'm saying because I had to look at a lot, a lot of hentai. Bro, 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 bro. I still wanted to talk about this because it pissed me off. How are you that stupid to the point where you would literally say that people are homophobic and that's the reason we got by Mineta? They are now saying that anime may cause cancer? Look at this Twitter screenshot of a Spanish news report. Now, it may look like you can't understand it, but I'll translate it for you. Does anime cause anal cancer? know how to avoid it. SAO is bad because they give character development to the wrong people at the wrong times. Baruto is literally just a my dad can beat up you compilation. I wouldn't be surprised if the artist for Food Wars was previously a hentai artist. I hate Eden Zero for stealing my name and making it a basic ass job in the show. Attack on Titan is the Game of Thrones of anime, which explains why the ending was terrible. The Devil is a Part-Timer is only funny because it's more realistic than most other comedy anime. Even with the whole god and demon lord thing. A cat girl has genetically attached cat ears and sometimes a tail, which are all genetic. And when talking about speaking in uwu and owo, they sometimes do speak in the language. But let's be honest, who hasn't unironically said uwu to something your mates have said? My Hero Academia is literally just an I'm quirky compilation. If Fluffy can stretch his entire body, how far can is this anime is known for having one of the most toxic fan bases? Ooh. Sort of online. Oh yes. no, it could be My Hero Academia though. Ooh, is that it's your... in between. You know what? I, I will say My Hero. That is correct. <laughs> all right, My Hero sends oh. you here. Here, go attack this person, not me. All right. Oh wait, but it's true though. It's so toxic. <laughs> <laughs> Let me call up Mason and ask him. Mason, I need you to name an anime. Ghost stories. Yep, he went after them. Maybe in a good light, but he still roasts the hell out of them. As well as Love is War, Food Wars, No Game No Life, and Domestic Girlfriend, which is honestly understandable. You name it, he's probably talked about it. I mean, hell, he even went after Doki Doki Literature Club. This isn't even an anime. At number one, we have Meliodas from Seven Deadly Sins. And my god, do I already hate this list. There are some things in anime we just have to accept. No Game No Life will probably never get another season. Hunter Hunter may always be incomplete. Luffy may never find the One Piece, and my favorite one of them all, Bleach is part of the big three and will always be. For our first episode of this series, I choose a classic, High School DxD. Well, in the case of Bunny Girl Senpai, every song is a banger, whether that be this banger OST, this banger ending, or the background songs for when Sakuta is running through the rain. Guys, I'm an anime sexual. Favorite coupleship. Favorite coupleship is Futuro and Miku. I'm not complaining about that. I'm complaining about the fact that it's higher up than Horimiya, Ryudus, and Eris, and it's higher up than those two. 
That's what I'm mad about. Why did you change the name to Cock Muffin? <laughs> I don't know. Disappointed. Mokana can show you Sea Scoop, bro. Because he showed me Sea Scoop and like. WHAT THE FUCK?! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, AK. I didn't even touch the Oh! The second I pull out my grenade, the game goes decide to give the person to push the bus to me. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. He's behind you. Where is he? <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Every minute, a minute passes. Wait, wait, wait. I need to listen. <laughs> <laughs> He's clutching, I'm just talking about random shit. Well, I'm not even- Well! Wow! He's so good at video games, he's so good at video games, he's so good at video games, he's so good at video games. Oh, video games. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, Matt underscore Redfish on Twitch! Matt underscore Redfish on Twitch! Oh, <laughs> 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 I get the roll. Oh my god, I like that guy! Oh, that's okay. Yeah! That gave me a good opportunity to look at the astounding visuals. It was like watching one of those anime transitions you could see on Twitter or TikTok, but in a format that would actually make sense. Come here. Don't crash. Please. Crash. Crash on him. No. Do it. No. Crash. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta go get a towel. <laughs> that Please. Was awesome. Please. Don't tell me I have to motion track it. There's nothing there! I got a blueprint. That's cool. <laughs> Burps, ribbit. I'm not gonna clip it. <laughs> ribbit. Did you clip that? No, I literally cannot. There's hentai on my screen. <laughs> <laughs> Racism is prejudice, discrimination, or antagonism of a different race. AKA, you just hate on a person because of the race. So how can we end this with anime? Kane coins. He spent money on anime. He has purchased these games and therefore spending money on anime. And that is very weeb. I, I know, Dester, uh... You like hentai? Of course, we're men of culture. Yeah, we're men of culture, my boy. We appreciate different religions. I was watching Jobless Reincarnation, because it's probably one of the best isekais I've ever seen. Did you just say isekai? I don't know how to fucking say it. Isekai, you fucking normie. Isekai? Thank you for the uh, beginning clip to uh, exposing Mason, because every time I see a picture of Kisuke Urahara, I can't stop. Fuck. Thinking about feels a fuck in Minecraft. And Jesus is this holy guy known for being this all Christian being. And everyone knows that Christianity is based around the holy thigh bolt. I'm learning clothing. You're learning clothing in Spanish? I'm learning how to not fuck up and be racist. Can we stop with this bit, please? <laughs> <laughs> Fortnite moments too, and that's gonna be the main thing. Fortnite moments <laughs> too, but it's just my balls. <laughs> Joel. What the fuck? I feel bad for the llama, bro. It's just getting beaten the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> Megumin from Konosuba. This looks like the enemy from a hat in time. 9 out of 10. Get that fucking smirk off your face and we'll raise it to a 10. Oh, 10! <laughs> <laughs> Those tits were sick. If you had D Luke and that, uh, and the greatsword, what mm. the fuck? <laughs> I don't know what's up. <laughs> hang on, 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 hang on. There's hang another on, guy. On, on. <laughs> okay, he's dead. Well, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Let him, let him go for the clip. Oh, sorry, sorry. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I didn't, I didn't know this was Byron because okay, okay. he changed his name. Okay, 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 okay. Ready? Ready? Oh. Yes. <laughs> so, hang on. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hold. Kill me. <laughs> no, no, girl, let's go! Ooh, girl. Oh, you may be wondering what got me into Honkai. Well, it was I. I was horny. I saw this meme on Reddit saying like Genshin Impact doesn't even have a skirt. 
We want Honkai as all this other shit, so now we're here. Goku has superhuman speed, strength, durability, senses, endurance, as well as powerful lungs, and is heat resistant. Now, Gojo has all of those things, but can be badass while doing it. Not really the same as Kazuma, but Rudeus, I'm going to call him Rudy for this video, but Rudy is actually useful. That's Bisky from Hunter x Hunter. I love her. You Dude, say Hunter x Hunter. Hunter. You point. say hunt. You say Hunter I'm x Hunter. Hunt Hunter. Okay. <laughs> she's like a man. What the fuck? No. Oh my god. She's so good. I love her. She's like 80 or 50. I don't know. She's 40. Thank you. Um, she's a hot. Okay. She's really strong. Be Lolly. <laughs> There we go. I asked them this one question and they immediately shut up. Why are you laughing? I'm making more money than you are. The room was more silent than Rem in season two of ReZero. If a cat gives birth to a cat girl, then we can say for certain that liking cat girls is considered bestiality. Proving that liking lollies is legal using the law of conservation of matter. Next up to the chopping block is Mio. Mio will kick my ass. I don't care how fucking strong you could be, Mio will kick your ass. But hey, I'm not complaining. But Suzu isn't satisfied, so they do the do. They service each other for a good bit, so they do the do for a few pages and end the do with her saying meow. Mommy actually questions if he's experienced, so they please each other. Satoru thinks they should go take a bath, but Haruka has something else in mind. She wants to have a good time with Satoru, and straddles over him. This freaks out her MC again, but she says not to worry about it. So they kiss and do the do. But she made sure they drank a lot during dinner, which creeps out her MC, but not enough to the point where they can't do the do. And so they do the do, our love interest tells them to just do it, and that she's gonna do something awesome for him. In short, she gave him the Gawk Gawk 3000, baby. Whoa. But then we get this very wholesome scene where Ari asks if Sadie regrets meeting him. And in response, Sadie says, Meeting Ari is the best thing that's ever happened to me. I love you. Ari responds as anyone would, and they continue to do the do. You're being awfully cheeky for someone who is just a good time doll. She doesn't pay any mind to that and starts to go back in for round two with the lower half. And he starts to go, ham, bro. I'm talking ruthless. But Nanami reassures her, saying, you don't have to worry about me. I'm just a customer. So they do the do for a bit, but if she truly is the same as her, then she must be on this train. And lo and behold, there she is, immediately copying a feel and going back in for round two. And we see this somewhat artistic masterpiece of a shot. Hoshino collapsed out of nowhere, so she carried him and nursed him until he woke up because her legs are falling asleep. But Hoshino doesn't want to get up because he can't find a pill this good. And so she straddles over him, and we see her saying that she never thought about being his girlfriend or going on a date with him, and that she did like him, but he seriously loves her and doesn't want her to go out with anyone but him. So they do the do. So Zen, being the adolescent boy, gets a little excited excited during this and Rina gives him that go, go, 3, baby. so she blasts the music strips and says that they're gonna cool off if they go somewhere else so they're gonna do it right there they do the do and finish up it cuts tonight and the nuns are on separate beds and the two sister nuns at the beginning tell the truth about baby making and how it's a disgusting and deplorable act the two strip and do the do with Kai she walked in on him pleasuring himself and after that she sat on her bed curled up not only because she saw him doing it but because he was doing it to a DVD about ponytails. What is you gonna do though? It cuts Satoko at the door and buzzes to see if you is up, which freaks you out because she told her not to come. The show follows our main character, Kiyotaka Ayunokoji an unenthusiastic high school student who doesn't like to put in any effort. We haven't seen this before, right? It's not like we've seen the Kyoto Animation's masterpiece that is Hioka. But instead of the main love interest being a little curious head, we get a character who's a classical tsunder, Kyoko Hori and Izumi Miyamura. While they are the main characters, the anime doesn't put the main focus on them. But then we get to the girl you see in my outro card. Her name is Nayu, and she is so horny on main for our main protagonist that literally almost everything that comes out of her mouth is a remark to either have relations or to do the deed with our main protagonist. Tokiwa runs over to see if she's alright, but Kuragano set him up, because if she did that, Tokiwa would have definitely walked up to her. Kuragano has hit her limit, so they do the do in the nurse's office, and it's the first First time so this is bound to be interesting basically what I'm trying to say is go watch the uncensored version of the show. It develops a story about this gang and the characters in it, showing character development with this gang, ultimately making the masterpiece that is the show. Let's talk usability. Usability? Usability? 
USA ability, baby. With the show being mainly focused about saving their friends from suicide by fighting to protect the Wonder Egg Child, which is a person who's died by suicide already and someone trying to fight to get them back. A Wonder Egg Child is summoned by the cracking of a Wonder Egg and teleporting the person that cracked it to an alternate dream universe. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. Get out of here. Get out of here. Right. Evan, don't clip that. Evan, do that. Evan, don't clip Turn the faucet all the way. God. God damn, bro. No wonder these people are being haunted. <laughs> they exactly. Got the ghost is just like, God damn it, you're plumbing. God damn, bro. Water your, water, your water bill is going to go skyrocketing, yeah. bro. <laughs> we saw someone's family. <laughs> Yo. I'm going to have a full hard drive by the end of this. Yeah, you bet you fall and hard. Yeah. <laughs> Look at Todoroki. He's just a piece of ice. Why is Zero so tall? But the one manga that caught my eye the most was Tokyo Ghoul. Now keep in mind that I'm seven or eight at the time, not knowing about manga and the world of anime. Listen, pre-glow up Post Malone. How about you have another coping mechanism other than making fun of your ex's boyfriend? <laughs> yup. Chaos indeed. Frostbite chaos. Oh, 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 got him. oh, that's like that's like a play on words. I'm alone. I went to go make dinner and come back to over 900 quote retweets, assuming I was talking about Dream when it was a jab at past content creators making weird music. To even interpret that as an attack on Dream says no more about you than me when I said nobody in particular. Wait a second. He even used anime for clickbait, but that's only half of it. Next is Jake with 354768. Basically, the three love interests of the story are giants, and our MC does the deal with all of them. Overall, rating a 7 out of 10. I love giants because I want to be stepped on. Next is Totally Working On It with 369123. The story follows our main character looking for his cat when it gets found by this girl with big booba, and so she returns it to the cat, and the MC allows her to play with it, and then they do the do. I rate this a 7 out of 10. Direct second submission is 365554. Basically our MC Akiharu lives with his maid Miuri and goes through the life of that, but finds a book and reads out one of the lines, which turns Miuri into a succubus, and it's somewhat of a wholesome read. 8 out of 10. Next is 309463. I don't remember Mitsuru being a futa. 7 out of 10. You know the drill at this point. I give a brief summary of the plot of the story and give a rating. Plus, I hope these are good, because why else would Korone be there? The next one is pretty long. 366087. Basically, our main character has a switch that can stop time, but he gets caught doing the deed with someone, so it goes down in a downward spiral, and they eventually fall in love. I give this an 8 out of 10. It was a pretty long read, but it was a good and pretty sad one at the end. A band. Wait a second. Alright, I'm gonna go beat up these guys, and then I'm seriously gonna take a break, because I'm tired. Number 1 PewDiePie Bridge Incident. No one wine. <laughs> that was hot. Beat goes hard. Splatoon three. three. Yo, they counted as a three, guys. <laughs> oh my god. I don't want to do another gaming video tomorrow, so I don't know what I'm gonna do. Doc part two. Doc part two. All right. Exposing Docimus part two. Mason, it, it it's National Anime Day. <laughs> That's your video. That's your video. I already uploaded Among Us. Up, up, but again. I'm fucking uploading. A silent voice was inside. Had one crazy moment, but then was inside. Pancreas did get me a little towards the end. Haven't watched your name yet, but will. You're f***ing crazy if you think that a silent voice wasn't said and that Pancreas got you a little. Or you're just a husk of a person. 306321, a lizard one. This story follows our two protagonists. 
a dragon lord, and Belle. Belle can look at her because he gets excited, so he doesn't make eye contact with her and she gets pissed. We now see them do the deed, and they end, but we see them fighting a monster, and the dojin ends with a high five. At number 10, he has Yojo Senkai, or Saga of Tanya the Evil. I don't know a lot about this anime, but from just the Google image results, I'm glad to see that the Iron Cross is still around from 1941. Number 10 is Saitama from One Punch Man. This man is a literal god with godlike powers but has trouble smacking a fly. Okabe from Steins Gate. Smart guy from the sci-fi show. Nice. Number five is Yuki from Fruits Basket. He looks like he talks mad shit, but when it comes down to it, he'll fold like a clam. Armin. This does not specify which anime it's from, so I'm gonna assume it's Armin Arlert from Attack on Titan. And I don't see any way for me to roast this character, seeing as they already hurt themselves and put themselves out of commission after becoming a titan. Number eight is Hori from Hori Mia. Ah... So now it makes sense. He's a masochist. His 10th favorite is actually two. Yotsuba from the Quintuplets anime and Emilia from ReZero. I can understand Yotsuba, but I don't really think Emilia would be one of the people I'd put on my list. I mean, there are so many better people to put on your list. Like an actual garbage can. Number seven is Miyazono Kaori from Your Line April. Guys, I think I know her zodiac sign. Number 8 is Shoya Ishida from A Silent Voice. Depressed after being bullied and later becoming friends with the girl he bullied, kind of sounds like a less specific version of the movie. Negative 2 times negative 2 equals positive 4. With this, we can use the theory and apply it to traps. In short, to put an end to this debate, Rem is best girl from ReZero, and using Newton's first law of motion, we scientifically proved it. Number six, Rem from ReZero. Oh. Basically, the point of this video is saying that I'm probably gonna drop anything I'm watching and watch mob. I'm waiting. Wait, this game is amazing. I can use emotes. Yes. Are you JoJo posing? So you may notice this is not my normal background. Well, this is this is a mother JoJo game where I'm a JoJo character and my stand is apparently Golden Requiem and I'm in a Discord call with my friends and we're beating the shit out of each other because that's just what JoJo is. Yeah, golf! Only middle-aged men would be happy about this. But there's one thing about it. I'll play a segment from a song that I like that's also an AMV. Ronin, all girls are the same. The anime in the background is Nisekoi, in an anime I like. But the anime twists, turns, and darkens the video so it looks terrible. For example, they have to censor themselves when they talk and say the word hentai. Rikudo Sato. He has to get diabetes before he can do anything as a hero. You can barely scroll through one row of his videos without seeing a clickbait thumbnail or title. Clickbait is just hentai. At number three, we have Deku's shoes. These bad boys can withstand one for all at 100%, which if you remember from the first season, will literally rip his clothes, making them not only the third strongest thing in all of anime, but also the strongest thing in all of the My Hero universe. Everyone's personality matches one character from My Hero Academia. Who are you? We'll just do this Shy. one as a group, because I'm not doing this quiz four times again. Shy. What do you like to do in your free time? Video game. Hang out with, fr hang out with friends. Blue. Red. Orange. Blood red. Red. Blood red. Blood red. Blood red. We don't read it. Sleep. Sleep. <laughs> What's your favorite anime? I feel like this one goes without saying, yeah? Yeah. Oh. Oh How are you gonna counter a notebook that game ends people within 40 seconds of their name being written down? And not to mention that Misa has the eyes, so literally everyone is dead besides her. But hey, I'm not complaining. That face when TikTok removes your video for nudity or activity when there's literally none and everything is censored in both the TikTok and the actual video? No! TikTok hates hentai. Number 7, Robert EO Speedwagon from JoJo. Honestly. 10 out of 10. Speedwagon, he's not gay. He just ran out of woman. Gamering on hoes harder than I gamered on your mom last night. No. I'm coming over to you, Mason. Where are you? Mom, I'm getting such bad FPS now, though. <gasps> <laughs> There's so many dinner plays after me, bro. <laughs> dinner plays. You said you laughed at my joke. I'm sorry. <laughs> dinner plays. <laughs> 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 uh, dude, I eat chicken. No, that's a good impression. Do it again. Do it again. 
<laughs> You're like a stupid kid in like a magic show. <laughs> hey, do it again! Yeah, do it again! Do it again! <laughs> he took my nose. Do it again. <laughs> Who said we weren't funny, Mason? <laughs> what a Keck W moment, dude. Hey, pull the bunny out of the head. Do it again. You pull the bunny out of your ass. <laughs> oh my god, I'm crying. Why are you crying? <laughs> Start smiling. It's a happy moment. <laughs> Why are you crying? Wait, how oh are you god. laughing that hard? <laughs> <You're crying. laughs> the image of a fucking retarded kid in a fucking magic <laughs> <thing>. <laughs> It was really funny to me. <laughs> Lock it up. Come over here. Toka from Tokyo Ghoul. You want to eat people but are constrained by the laws of the world. Ganyu. You're probably really hardworking or realize that demigods can be hot. Zero Two from Darling in the Franks. Do you actually like her or were you told to like her? Either way, the way she says daddy hits different. Astolfo from the Fate series. This is obviously best girl from all of Fate. Wait a second, who keeps putting dudes on this list? Shina Mashiro from Sakura Soul. You have no clue what year it is. And the person that has the best rip in all of anime is Cory from Cory in the House. Killua from Hunter Hunter. Undoubtedly the person with the best rip in anime. We have this one, this one, this one, this one, this one, this one. There's a lot. And men's knew how to drip. Well, if you've seen Demon Slayer and talked with anyone about it, you'll remember the fight scene from episode 19. The neurons in your brain watched that scene and realized this wonderful chemical called dopamine. A while back I saw this tweet. So let's look at some of the responses because why not? Jojo? Oh god he got ratioed. Oh no let's not talk to this man. Catboys will just let it slide whereas cat girls will never let you hear the end of it. And not to mention that cat girls will start hissing at you. Why dubs can be better than subs. Death Note, because of L. Mob had to accept the fact he will never fit in. Subaru had to die over and over again. Shinji, well, he's just depressed. The MHA fandom, a toxic hellhole where no one hopes to be. How it came to be this way, I have zero clue. But what I do know is the toxic things the fandom has done. And if Deku wants to make people smile, he could have just become a comedian even though the only thing funny about him is the fact that he can't win a fight without a flashback. Take- Yes, go over there. It's Evan, shut the fuck up, I'm trying to concentrate, Evan's yelling at me. Uh, Spread the guy shooting at the top! What are you doing?! Shut up! You're being shot at both above you! Holy shit! Oh shit! That's not your teammate, why are you doing- I'm really good. Hey, can you guys ready up? <laughs> <laughs> and you've probably watched some pretty good animes like Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood, Steins Gate, or maybe High School DX, one that fits your preference. And this tweet explains itself. Basically, this video that I'm making right now is saying why the upload yesterday may have been weird and what happened with it. And if you're still confused, the gist of it is YouTube doesn't like big anime titties. Also meaning that the non-sauce videos would be earlier in the week, like a Monday or Tuesday. And who the fuck keeps messaging me? When face reveal. <sighs> I guess I did pass 1,000 subs, so might as well. Now before I do this, just remember that I do look really ugly. Here we go. Hi. So yeah, um, this is me. Hi, I'm, I'm Makina. This is really, I don't know how to do this. But yeah, uh, I'm gonna be uploading a room tour in the future so you guys can see everything that's going on in the background. And don't worry, uh, I'm changing out, changing out those lights right there. On screen, like here. There's a there's a thing that I'm buying. So the sign came in. This is it on the lowest fucking brightness. I got a sign. But in all seriousness, thank you guys so much for an awesome 2021. And um, here's to a better 2022. But that's enough for me. Roll the outro. Attack on Titan, Tokyo Ghoul. These hentai babes make me drool. Hasune Biku is great. She makes me masturbate. Fairy tale.